Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got some exciting news to share with you. There's a brand new AI video generation tool that you can use for free, and the results are absolutely mind-blowing. I have to say, the AI space is evolving at such a rapid pace. It's just wild! The tool is called Pika 1.5, and today I'll be giving you a beginner's tutorial and an in-depth review of its features. So, let's jump right in. What is Pika 1.5? Pika is an innovative AI video generation tool developed by PhD students at Stanford University, designed to simplify the video creation process. No matter your experience level, Pika allows you to turn your ideas into captivating videos effortlessly. It can transform text, images, and video into immersive, cinematic content, complete with advanced features like peak effects, cinematic shots, and realistic animations. But before we dive into the tutorial, let's check out their trailer. From the video, you can see the FX are fantastic, no flickering or lag crisp details, and excellent stability. Now, you might think these results are hand-picked, but even so, the output quality will satisfy most users' needs. And it's still free for now, though there's no guarantee they won't change that later. So it's worth giving it a try while you can. Now, let's get into the beginner's tutorial. How to use Pika 1.5. First, click the link in the video description to visit Pika 1.5's official website. Once you're there, click Sign In in the top right corner, and you can create an account or log in using your Google or Discord credentials. I recommend using Google for quicker access. Once you're logged in, you'll see the trailer again. Feel free to give it another watch if you're interested. Now, click Try Now to get started. The first feature you'll notice is Peak Effect. This allows you to add effects like squishing, crushing, or melting to your uploaded images. We've seen a lot of AI tools, but Pika 1.5 is the only one that can do this. It's super cool. Using it is really easy. Just click on the effect you want and select the image you want to apply it to. Next is the Upload an Image function. Click the Image button in the lower left corner to upload a photo, which you can edit in all kinds of fun ways. If you want to add Peak Effect, I recommend using a photo where the subject is centered and clearly visible for the best results. The third feature is the prompt input box. If you want to create an AI-generated video, just type in the key prompt for what you want to create, then hit the star button on the right. Pika will automatically generate a video for you, which usually takes around two minutes. We tried a snowman melting example, and it even added sound effects. So cool. If you like the result, you can download it by clicking the download button. If not, hit retry or reprompt to try again. Advanced tips and tricks. Now, onto the advanced tutorial. We discovered a few tricks that can save you a lot of time when creating your videos. Tip one, advanced options. In the bottom right corner of the prompt input box, there's an advanced options button that many people might miss. This feature has three parameters, negative prompt, seed, and aspect ratio. In simple terms, negative prompt lets you filter out things you don't want in your video, like low resolution, blurriness, or laggy frames. This can save you a lot of trial and error time. Seed is a bit more complex. It allows you to tweak a video you've already made without starting from scratch. You can find the seed value in the video details at the bottom right. Finally, aspect ratio lets you adjust the video dimensions to fit your needs. Tip two, explore. If you're new to prompt writing and not sure what to type, the Explore feature will be a huge help. Here, you'll find all kinds of templates uploaded by other creators. If you see a video you like, just click Reprompt to use the same prompt and image or delete their image and upload your own to create a similar video. Tip three, join the community challenge. After creating your video, you can click the Share button to join the community challenge. This gives you a chance to earn points and share your work with other Pika users. It's a great way to collaborate and get inspiration from others. Pricing. Now let's talk about Pika's pricing plans. While it offers a free tier, it's not unlimited. You get 150 credits per month and each video costs 15 credits to make. So make sure to manage your credits wisely. If you run out, you can always create another account. Or if you have the budget, consider upgrading to a paid plan. This gives you more credits faster video generation, watermark free downloads, and access to Pika 1.0's exclusive features like lip syncing, partial area edits, longer videos, and higher resolutions. It all depends on what you need. So that's it. You can try all these amazing effects for free on their website right now. 
If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel for more AI news. See you next time.